All right, guys. Welcome back to another video at Kennedy again. Oh, I got obviously got the camera on. Kind of freaking feel my pocket here, my sweatshirt or underneath my flannel because I got an extra battery with me and I should just put my extra battery in my bag, but I don't know. I might do that after the vlog. And I was just you know, I was just telling the ride crew too. The stupid shit I do for YouTube, man. Like I'll go out and film whether it's a vlog, a riding video, an RC one, or whatever. Well, crafting ones I can just still do in my garage, you know? But, you know, gaming, I, I do that in the house unless if I'm, like, camping or whatever. So then I'll be in the camper or, you know, on my phone. Uh, or even the ghost hunt stuff I kind of do too or wherever. Um, but, but the main ones I, you know, the main ones I upload upload to regularly is the vlogs and the riding. And the gaming when I get a stockpile of videos. Um, which I should start doing that again too because I'm getting a stockpile of videos and... I got like two flash drives full already. Working on getting the third one done. I should just fucking... I mean, because I just did a live stream last night on the gaming channel. Uh, but, you know, whatever. Um, Because I even thought about doing a, like a... live stream you know connect my gopro to my phone and then do a, like a live stream on youtube and do it at base shore and do like a base shore live stream or at home and do it or even i thought about doing Cause my, I got the idea, kind of got the idea from my grandfather, my mom's dad. Because he does live streams on Facebook every now and then. Because he's got like the, the camera that you hook up to like your computer. Um, So then he'll have has it mounted up somewhere above his computer so you can see most of his garage. And uh okay. and, uh, and then he'll do that for like an hour or two. I I wouldn't be looking at doing an hour, but you know I'd be doing long enough to get something mostly built. Um, you know, and whatever, you know. Well, back to the doing something stupid for YouTube. So I was telling the riders, um, that I would do something stupid for. YouTube, you know, like right now I'm out wearing a fucking flannel and a sweatshirt hat and my riding gloves. Um. Just to fucking film. I mean, yeah, I could, if I would order a little bit of a bigger size riding glove... I'd be okay wearing, you know, a thin glove on underneath it. 
you know, because because I got winter gloves, but I don't like riding in winter gloves because it it feels weird. You know, I can't. You know, I feel like I can't function fully with you know winter gloves on on a, on the bike. Um. So hence why I wear my riding gloves. Um. And I'm looking at getting a different or a riding or a frame bag for the BMX bike. I'm gonna have to mount it down there, not down by the bottom bracket by the crank. Because I can't mount it normally. Like, because I can't. Because normally it mounts up, up here where I'm pointing, where the fast the, this finger is pointing. I can't mount it up here normally because it'll uh, break. I mean, I could at least try, but and I am, but but I'm thinking I'm gonna have to probably mount it down by the crank upside down. And mom's in, and they're gonna ask, well, why you mount it like that? I like, cause I can't mount it on the top tube like how it's normally supposed to be mounted because of the brake. Because the brake is upside down, cause it's a, I'm assuming a street like style frame. Um, cause if I did my re research right. Street frames are have the brakes mounted upside down. So I know it ain't gonna be easy to explain with my fat tire, but so the street brakes mount up here. Up here. And then dirt frames mount down here so that when they're on the chain stays. So the brake is on the chain stay, and then the that the dirt frames the brake is on the uh, chain stay. Street frames they mount on the seat stay tube, you know that upper frame or the upper tube for the frame that I was just pointing at. This one here. So this is your seat stay here, chain stays down there. So I'm assuming I got a street frame. Which I kind of wish it was a dirt frame because then the you know the cable would be right on down the you know so that's why I think because my brother you know if you guys remember my Harrow back trail X one that I had that I did the bike check the bike check video I was on at Bay Shore that one year my green and gold bike. That was a dirt style bike, you know, so you don't know, you know, for so it'd be for like doing dirt jumps and and all that. So I think it might be like dirt or park. I don't know. I don't understand the shit, all that shit enough. So, um, yeah, so I don't know. I'll, I'll cause I put it on my Christmas list and you know what I wanted as, you know, cause I wanted a frame bag. And my mom and dad are going to be like, what for? And I'm going to tell them, well, for the BMX bike. Because then I'm going to keep a notebook in there. And then all the riding gloves I'll keep in there. Um, so on and so forth. So... Um, but anyway, guys, I'm going to end the video here and get some riding done, and I'm going to go eat some lunch and shit, so I'm hungry for a quick trip, so, uh, uh, but anyway, guys, I'm going to end the video here, and I'll see you guys in the next video.